Hello friends and welcome back to the horror section. This is going to be a pickups video, an Anchor Bay pickups video, so here we go. First of all, I got this uh, Evil Dead uh, PSP. Uh, I don't really know much about these. I don't even have a PSP. I just got it because it's Evil Dead. I think this is called UMD Videos. I don't really know, you know. You can... Uh, Please uh, put in the comments below if you know a lot about these things. I'm not really for sure. The only reason I got it was, of course, it's Anchor Bay, which is pretty cool. And then it's a uh, Evil Dead. But then you open it up and it's got this cool little, I don't know, these weird looking things you can play on. That's kind of cool. Pretty neat. I just figured I'd pick it up since it was Evil Dead. Plus it's an Anchor Bay, so you can't go wrong either way. And I found it pretty cheap, so I figured I'd get it. Pretty neat. It's a little rough looking. I wish the case was a little better in better shape, but I ain't going to complain. Pretty cool. It's got a little bit of indention right there. It's kind of wore a little bit, but it ain't too bad. I thought it was pretty cool. So that's um, PSP, the Evil Dead. Pretty cool. Anchor Bay. So that's kind of cool. Next is, I have no idea what this is, the uh, Osterman Weekend. So I don't know what this is. I have no idea. It's pretty cool, though. It's an anchor bay. And like I said, it comes in this cool kind of slip case right here, which I like these when they're on top and the bottom. I don't really know what you call these. You kind of just pull them out like this. It's like a slip box or something. Pretty cool. Now, I've never heard of this movie. I just got it because it was Anchor Bay. I kind of got a few uh, Anchor Bay titles, and this was just one of them. I kind of got it for one certain title, but I got quite a, I got four of them all together. And I sort of got it for the one title because it's worth you know getting for the one title. So I got these thrown in. So if anybody's seen this one, it sounds like it might be pretty good. I think it's got uh, Rudger Howard, Dennis Hopper, Burt Lancaster, Craig T. Nelson, Coach, <laughs> and uh, John Hurt. So it can't be too bad. I just never heard of it. I don't know. It looks like it might be pretty good, though. But uh, like I said, if you've seen this thing or know anything about it, just leave it in the comments. It's kind of cool. Oh, it's the final film by director Sam Peckinpah. A lot of people like him. So it might be pretty good. But like I said, if you know anything about this, then please uh, leave down there in the comments. It looks pretty cool. And like I said, Dead and Breakfast, which I had this a long time ago. I didn't really like it that good. I didn't think it was that great to me. I mean, some people like it, but I don't know. I just got it because it was with the uh, with the other ones I got. Like I said, there's the Anchor Bay. It's got a few pretty good... Uh, Pretty good, decent actors. David Carradine's in there. Jeremy Sit Sitto. I never can pronounce his name. And uh, Ever Carradine. So it's got some pretty good people in it. I just don't remember that much about it. I didn't really like it. when It's more like a kind of just a comedy, kind of a horror comedy. But like I said, I ain't seen it in a long time. I probably need to watch it again. But I just don't remember that much about it. You know, so that's Dead and Breakfast. Just another one of those films I got with the other four. And like I said, I'll show you at the end which movie that I kind of got it for to get all. Plus, I got all these, so that's kind of cool. And then I got Hellbound Hellraiser 2, which I didn't have this one. I had it like where you would get both of them. So, you know, I don't mind picking these up since they're Anchor Bay. Just add to my Anchor Bay collection. Like I said, you know, just kind of cool that you get all of them. For pretty much the price that this last one would probably cost anyways, you know. If you was to buy this one I got, my buddy picked these up for me, and he pretty much paid. I, I don't like to talk about prices, so I ain't going to say anything, but he pretty much pay, got all four of these for the same price that this last one. I'll show you what it is. So this is Hellbound Hellraiser 2. And Fear No Evil is the one I was really wanting. This one's kind of hard to find, I believe. And I got all four of these for the price that you usually pay for just this one. I don't know what the guy, I mean, it's in great. All of them are in pretty decent shape, you know. There's nothing wrong with them. But, you know, this one's kind of hard to find, and it's kind of, people like it pretty good. And I noticed, like, on eBay that this one by itself is going for about the same price my buddy paid for all of these. So I thought that was a really good deal. 
you know. I wasn't going to compla complain, but uh, like I said, I kind of just got it for this one. Fear no evil. I, I've seen this one, but it's been a long time ago, but I just want to add it to my collection. Plus, it, like I said, it's another uh, Anchor Bay, all four of these. So I thought, heck, four movies for the price that this one probably costs by itself. You can't really go wrong. So that's Fear No Evil. So I pretty much got this one, that one, that one, and that one for the price that that, that first one, usually Fear No Evil, usually costs. So that's a pretty good deal. All four of these were about the same. Like I said, I looked this one up, and most places, there's a couple of them that had it for about the same price that all of these cost, and most of them had it for more. So I thought that was a pretty good deal, you know, and getting all these for the same price that this one usually costs by itself. So, but, uh, that's my latest pickups, my Anchor Bay pickups. I hope you enjoy it and, uh, thank you and see you, see you next video. I appreciate it, man. See you.